Welcome back, Veggie family. Today we are going to be talking about snacking. So, to snack or not to snack? To snack. Of course, Eric, you would say that. But let's get down to business here. So as many of you know, us Americans, we consume a lot of extra calories sometimes. And most calories that we get are from unhealthy options. So we're going to talk about today what we can do about that. Well, most of the time when we are eating snacks, we are eating them between meals. Sometimes we're using them as meal replacements. And sometimes we're just eating for no reason, right? We might be eating stress for stress. We might be eating because we're grieving. Or we might just be mindlessly eating a snack. I eat when I'm happy. You eat every moment. Eric. I'm always happy. Okay, so let's talk about should we snack or should we not snack. So, again, some people have to snack because they actually do need extra calories. And they have had a conversation with their physician and they have been told to increase their calories. So, that makes perfect sense. Now, first of all, for the others, we need to determine, first of all, are we even hungry? Because, again, sometimes we're just mindlessly snacking. Also, we need to figure out, or are we snacking because we're not getting the things that we need during our meals? Are we not eating all of our fruits and veggies and all of those things that we need? So we must determine that first. Then, if we are snacking, we must be snacking healthy. So we're talking about fruits and vegetables. Everybody loves fruits and vegetables. We're talking about dairy. If you are a lacto-vegetarian, you can look at healthy dairy options. Then... Things that I love, whole grain snacks like crackers, those are great. Popcorn, just plain popcorn that you've air popped, that's excellent. Nuts and seeds. There are so many things out there that you can eat that are healthy. Then also, we want to make sure when you are snacking that you're choosing the right portions. So if we are going to have that cup of popcorn, we're not going to have a giant bowl of popcorn, but we're simply going to have a cup of popcorn. Okay, so in order to help control that mindless eating where we are just snacking for no reason, first of all, let's take a moment to enjoy what we're eating. When you sit down to eat, have a conversation. Actually take time to chew your food and actually taste it instead of just swallowing it up. Also, remove the candy dishes from your house. Replace it with a fruit bowl. If it's not there, you can't eat it. And make sure you are buying healthy options because, again, if we are buying unhealthy options, then when it is time that we want a snack, what are we going to choose? An unhealthy option. So don't buy the junk food, guys. Buy the fruits and veggies and the seeds and the nuts. Then also make sure you are planning ahead of time for your snacks, okay? So if you're going to work for the day, go ahead and prepare your snacks ahead of time. Make sure you portion them out. Make sure you are choosing those healthy options so you aren't, um, you know, so tempted to run down the store to the gas station and grab that bag of chips. Um, also make sure you organize things at home. So in your refrigerator, put those healthy snacks where you can see them. If you have to dig, 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 dig in the refrigerator, Eric, you are not going to find those healthy snacks. So put them out front so everyone can see them. I'm going to find them. <laughs> and last but not least, let's talk about rethinking your drink. Okay, a lot of times we consume so many extra calories in drinks. First of all, I want to say to you, the most important thing to drink is water. Nobody really hates water. Water is delicious. So add some fruit. Add some fresh herbs in it. Just give it a try. And be very cautious of those extra drinks, especially those coffee drinks. I'm not a coffee lover, but you guys know what I'm talking about. So be aware of those. They do add up a lot of calories. Try to choose tea and coffee that's just black plain without adding any of that junk in it all right so we hope that you are going to take this information and we hope that you are going to now try to eat a little bit healthier on your snacks and we are so glad you joined us today and from vegetarian i'm shelly i'm eric and we hope you have a wonderful weekend goodbye bye we also hope you like and share and subscribe. And you didn't talk about soda. I'm really surprised. 
I just don't understand why you have to buy put soda every day and you didn't say soda. Don't drink soda. You're going to yell at me about soda, Especially but nobody Eric. else? I'm mad. I'm very mad now. I'm going to go sit in my mad corner. Now, now my camera will turn off. Now I'm more mad.